क्लिक द बेल आइकन टू गेट लेटेस्ट वीडियोस फ्रॉम ईकीडा हेलो फ्रेंड्स इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू सी प्रॉब्लम नंबर टू व्हिच इज बेस्ड ऑन इंटीग्रेशन बाय सब्सटिट्यूशन लेट अस स्टार्ट evaluate integral x raised to n minus 1 into cos of x raised to n dx here also friends we know that integration of cos x raised to n is not possible for that we must substitute a part as t after that taking its derivative the remaining part must be converted in terms of dt we have two options that is x raised to n minus 1 and cos of x raised to n if i substitute x raised to n minus 1 as t its derivative will be never x raised to n but if i substitute x raised to n as t in its derivative part i will get the term x raised to n minus 1 let us see how to do that put x raised to n as t differentiating the above function with respect to t derivative of x raised to n will give you n into x raised to n minus 1 and with x you can directly write dx and on the right hand side you can directly write it as dt further we need to check after substituting x raised to n as t the remaining part that is x raised to n minus 1 and the value of dx should be converted in terms of dt here you can see we have x raised to n minus 1 and also dx the extra part n can be transferred on the right hand side that will give you x raised to n minus 1 into dx as 1 upon n dt remember friends you can transfer only the constant part on the right hand side you can never take x on the right hand side therefore we have integral cos x raised to n is t and x raised to n minus 1 dx will give you 1 upon n dt 1 upon n being constant we can take it out of the integral cos t dt now we know that integration of cos t is sin t this will give you i is equal to 1 upon n sin t plus c the last step will be resubstituting the value of t resubstituting t is equal to x raised to n therefore i will be sin of x raised to n upon n plus c this becomes the integration of the given function I hope friends you have understood this problem thank you for watching this video stay tuned with ikida and subscribe ikida